happy when they said they were going to renew because you, know, you feel like they like they must like it enough to to bring us back. And I was excited to get another season with these guys and these characters. And yeah, I'm trying to manifest certain things. I'm like, I'm really hoping for third season. Is the way we ended on the cliffhanger. Yeah. I just feel like. I just remember that last read through was like the most amazing read through when you like threw a chair and like people were. I'm giving like. <laughs> Uh, we'll put it this it way: after we exciting. after we read through the six episodes, I don't normally I'm not a big crier, um, and I was bawling at the end of episode six. I'm really, I want uh, I want to know what goes on in season three. So it's it's really fun to be a part of this because it's just so there's a ton crammed in. Then the first episode we actually take off from the epic shootout, and so you're gonna see what happens. And then we're gonna take off like a year later, mm -hmm. and then a, a bit of a mysterious murder happens, and of course, someone. Everyone likes to pick on me, <laughs> but um, you, you, a lot of happen. You know, a lot happens in the first episode. So my character goes through a lot of <sighs> solitude, and he's in a lot of isolation. So you get to see a, a, a lot of vulnerability in my character, where um, you know his uh, his tribe kicks him out, but at the same time, it's when things are when you find out more, and they need you. With all that's happening on television now, there are a lot more opportunities. There, there's the freedom to explore different stories. You wouldn't see this story on one of the, you know, three main networks, and so there's room and transparent. Like that's not something. There's more room f to push what we've seen before and and see what else. People want to see something different. They, we don't want to keep seeing procedurals necessarily it's like we want to we want to be challenged and excited about what's coming next week i think there's some phenomenal material but you just get to get deeper with the character you get to spend so much more time in that i mean i would really love to be i mean like i love i get six hours to work with my character you know to work with my character instead of two i don't really join anything unless i'm having a great time and like <laughs> i i there's, there's no life is too short not to um I mean, all the grips, all the cameramen, it was, uh, this everyone. Crew, this season especially, everyone was so happy to be there and such good people. It was a joy every day to go to set. Yeah. It was really fun. I'm pretty pumped for everyone to see it too. I, uh, I think you definitely need to go to theaters and watch Batman Superman because I'll be there watching it with you. And I'm, I'll just put it this way. When I heard Zack's a genius, Zack Snyder's genius mind, I was like, my jaw dropped. My jaw doesn't normally drop. And I'm pretty excited for the world to see that, and um, and um, excited to join Justice League, and it's just going to be, it's it's, a, it's an honor, being a Polynesian, being a waterman, my family are watermen, to represent, you know, the brown, brown skin superheroes, baby, it's pretty cool.